Good evening. It's being heralded as a major breakthrough in treating diabetes. Overweight patients with the disease who took part in a trial treatment have stunned doctors by shedding a significant amount of weight in a matter of weeks. And we'll be talking to one of them in a moment. Doctors in Birmingham who led the trial also noticed blood sugar levels dropped dramatically and fitness levels improved. As our health correspondent, Michaeli Padwana, reports, it's hoped the trials will soon be rolled out across the NHS. 19 and a half uh, full fit. <laughs> For years, Nick Fahani had to buy his clothes from outside shops. His diabetes was out of control, even with the highest levels of medication. But having been selected for this trial, he lost four and a half stone in a year without having to try. It's incredible. You can get, you can get another person in there, can't you? <laughs> Look at that. Nick had a plastic tube inserted through his mouth into his upper small intestine. It was then opened up to act as a two-foot barrier, stopping food being absorbed into his blood. The procedure is less dangerous than surgery and simple to teach. The tube was then removed after a year. So this is it. It doesn't look much for £3,300, but when you consider that diabetes costs the NHS £11 billion a year, and that could double in the next 20 years, then this could turn out to be a good investment. The patient is also given a drug which further lowers sugar levels in the blood. Diabetes is a vicious circle. The more insulin people need, the more obese they become. Nick says this has given him new life. Yeah, especially my age, you know, where it's very difficult to lose weight. Uh, you know, I, I couldn't really imagine that I'd be at this weight and this size, let's say, a, a year ago when I first went on, on this uh, clinical trial with the endobarrier. There are potential side effects, including liver abscess. That's why the tube's removed. But the doctors involved in the study said that they've seen liver fat reduced drastically and believe it can save lives. I've seen huge numbers of patients over many years, and, and this group of patients are very different. It's the amount of happiness they have at, at what, what we, of the treatment we've given them. Uh, uh, and. I think I could probably have imagined that, but to actually experience it was, was real privilege for me as a doctor. Mr Fahani has no intention of going back to his old ways, but the next stage of the trial is to see if patients can keep the weight off. Yeah. Kelly Paduano, BBC Minns Today. Well, I'm joined now by Dr. Robert Ryder from City Hospital and Corinne Karim, who's undergone this treatment. Welcome to both of you. Hello. Dr. Ryder, if I can turn to you first. I mean, this really does seem to be quite a significant step forward in treatment of diabetes. Just give us an idea of how big a breakthrough it is. Well, that's, that's certainly my view, because um, we haven't had a, a, a treatment that is so simple for patients in this particular situation where they've come to the end of the line with all the other treatments and they're still with poor diabetes control and still overweight uh, and this is such a simple thing to put in an endoscopy and endoscopy units are all over the NHS already so potentially it's a big big step forward. And it's been a big deal for you hasn't it Corinne? Yes. Just give me some idea of the difference this has made to your life. This is an, as you can see it's an amazing transition. Um, I feel a lot better in myself, I can breathe better. Um, I had a lot of fat around my liver, my cholesterol levels were really high. What other doctors thought I was an alcoholic when I wasn't because of due to the fat around my liver and that's completely gone. I'm not in pain, I can move just like a normal person. You, you lost so much weight, in fact you can't quite remember how much because yeah. it was about three or four stone yes. or something like that. So yeah. what can you do now, Corinne, that you couldn't do before you had this treatment? Well, I'm a lot healthier. I can control my diabetes a lot better. It still feels like I have the endo barrier in. It's like something's telling me to stop. Before I would just eat and eat and eat because I didn't have control, whereas that's helped me have control. And, and my sugar levels are a lot better. And that's absolutely crucial, isn't it? It's the maintenance after the treatment, isn't it, Dr Ryder? Because it's all very well having this and losing the weight, but then making sure it doesn't creep back up again afterwards. Well, that's right. And we certainly, even before we put them in, we do warn patients that you know, the part of the deal is that they won't. And, and uh, Corinne is an example of someone who hasn't because she's now several months after it's been taken out and she hasn't been putting the weight back on. Mm. So you're confident that you're going to be able to hang on to the new you, as it were? Yeah. Yes, I am, because I've controlled it at the moment and my medication has been reduced as well. Yeah, so... It's so, a lot better. So life is looking pretty good for you. Okay. A lot better, yes. Corinne, thanks very much. And Dr Ryder, thanks very much okay, for you, you for coming in. Thank you. Thank you. The head of a chain of academy schools